Hi everyone, welcome to Mixed Media Soul Sparks. Sandra Duran Wilson here, and this time I have something really interesting to share with you. Now you might have seen one of my previous videos on making paper skins. So this is a similar idea, a little different process, but you're gonna end up with a gold leaf skin. And why would you wanna do that rather than applying gold leaf to a surface? because you can cut this stuff into shapes, you can use it in collage, you can do an amazing number of things with it. Stretch it, bend it, it's cool. So I'm gonna be using just a piece of heavy plastic. You could also use, um, you know, a Ziploc quart size bag. I've also done it on, this is a page protector. You want heavy plastic something that's going to, the gel is gonna peel away from. Some tape, scissors, and I'm using a regular gel gloss. You wanna make sure you use a gloss gel because it makes it the, the clearest. If all you have is matte, eh, use it, what the heck. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply a piece of tape to one side. Now you want your, you want your plastic to be at least the size of your leaf. So this is where the leaf is in here. It's a little smaller than this package. So I can say, okay, this is gonna fit on here just fine. And then I'm gonna take a piece of tape and put it on one edge. And I'll show you why. And if you forget to do this, well, I'll show you that it's okay too. It's a very forgiving process. Now I could put it on two sides, I could put it on four sides, it's up to you. Then I'm gonna take the gel and spread it onto this surface. I wanna apply a coat that's gonna be thick enough so there's no holes, but I don't want it so thick that it's gonna take it forever to dry. And I'm gonna take that gel and I'm gonna put it over the edge of that tape. And I'll show you why in a minute. Now I've got this on top of a silicone mat, which has a little bit of a color. So I can see if there's some holes, basically, if I see that, that mat below this white gel. But if you've got it on white, you may not be able to see that. So I'm using my knife to spread it. I can actually get a little texture too if I want. And you're probably thinking, what the heck is she gonna do with this? So let's put that back in there. Then if I hold it up, I might be able to see through if there's, if there's any holes. There's some over there and it's a little thick right there. So let's just kind of even that out. Now you're gonna set this aside and it's probably gonna take at least a day to dry. If you live in a cool, humid climate, it could take longer. And how are you gonna know when it's dry? It's gonna be clear. So I'm gonna set this out of the way. See, so that gel, it's white when it's wet and it dries clear. Now I see a few little spots here and you might notice that I didn't put the tape all the way around here. So if you didn't do it, the only thing you have to do is you have to be able to get a corner of it and be able to peel it off. Now this is still a little damp. You see where it's still white in that spot? That means it's still drying. But I have another one over here. This one I did on the page protector. And here's the advantage of having the tape on here is because you can pull the tape and if you've gone over the edge of the tape, then you will peel off the skin. But before I do that, I'm gonna show you how to attach the gold leaf. So here's the trick is you've probably seen me use alcohol, and this is isopropyl alcohol. I just use 70%. And if you're in other countries, 
sometimes I can find it as surgical spirits, other times I can't find it. This, when I use the alcohol to remove like dry paint, well, what it does is it gets the acrylic soft. So I'm gonna spray the alcohol directly onto this dry gel and just kind of let it dry. As I'm rubbing it, I'm feeling if it's getting tacky yet. The rubbing doesn't really have anything to do with the process other than knowing when is gonna be the proper time to apply the gold leaf. Now you don't have to use gold, you can use copper, you can use silver, you can use variegated leaf. See what I'm doing now? It's like, it's almost there. Now alcohol evaporates quickly, so you may need to spray some more on there. Oh, it's starting to get there. See how it's sticking to my hand? There we go. It's ready. Yeah, it's sticky. So now this is simple leaf. I'm going to take this out. It's called simple leaf because it's attached to a carrier paper, which makes it very, very simple. I just put it down on top of the sticky surface of the acrylic gel. Now you can use a, a oops, don't use a towel with stuff in it. You gotta come watch me for all the, the blooper reels here. <laughs> I'm just gonna use a paper towel to really make sure I burnish the leaf onto the acrylic. Then I'm gonna carefully take this paper off. See, that's the carrier paper. And then a light touch, I'm gonna start to, to burnish the gold leaf. Now this is where you come and you peel this off. I gotta take this glove off. Gloves and tape don't work too well. And you're gonna see what starts to happen, how it starts to crack and crinkle. Careful because it will stick to itself like it just did there. But this is what I love about this skin. Do you see how it stretches like this? Isn't that cool? It's almost like a gold leaf crackle. And then you wanna make sure that you spray this side with a varnish because that's gonna keep it from tarnishing down the road. It won't tarnish right away, but it will later on. So make sure you, you spray that with a varnish. And I'll just keep cutting this off. It's actually easier if I peel the whole thing off. It's a little sticky, so you get the idea. How to peel it off and then cut it from the tape. Or maybe just do this. So then when you get it completely off of your plastic carrier, then you can cut this into pieces. After you sprayed it, you can even paint it. If I use the, the silver leaf, here's a little piece I found, I can paint it with different colors. And I love that it has the texture and it has the crackles. It's, it's just a, a really one of my favorite things to make. So that's it for gold leaf skin. I'll just continue to battle this tape. But um, so you know, it's just not you if you're, if you're uh, having a hard time with this. <laughs> and if you wanna find out where to get some of these products, like the, the Simple Leaf or um, different paints, you can always check out my shop or my website. Make sure you sign up for the uh, channel so you see when new things are coming out and here we go now isn't that beautiful i just love it i like to stretch it too but store it in between pieces of wax paper otherwise it will stick to itself and you'll never get it apart so you can keep it on the plastic 
And then just put a piece of wax paper on top. You don't have to cut it off right away if you're not ready to use it. So all these great little tips. And uh, thank you for watching. And until the next time, happy creating. Join the Creative Awakening community on Facebook, where you'll be able to post your art, connect with other creatives around the world, and ask questions. Use the hashtag Mixed Media Soul Sparks when posting your work on social media. Thanks for joining me, 